Nothing to celebration like some goddamn absence and some lucky strikes. Oh. I don't like your fucking ball, man. So fucking birds. And I don't see any green fairies. Usually, when I want to see green fairies, I have to go to the fucking village on St. Patty's Day. But see, the thing is, Piggy, you fucking get cleaning this goddamn dumb mouse doing something to someone. I might cut my ear off and send it to someone. But see, the thing is, so you better clean that house or you're gonna get my fucking catchphrase. Oh, fuck. At least you know how to motivate me. Well, I'll do all this. Hmm. Why the fuck would this be here? Dude, why the fuck is this goddamn suicide book? Are you fucking telling me you don't know why we have a goddamn suicide book? Anyways, it's about Coiling Coventry. You know what happened in the bathroom, don't you? We fucking opt it, so. Don't fucking look at it. Don't like fucking you, too. Oh, uh, yeah, I saw it a bit, uh, but my computer wasn't working. The volume is too low. Yes, please inform me of that as I was not aware of this deceased. Although I have slept on a deceased member before, let me tell you. Anybody? Anybody? Okay, to go on. I have my own suspicions of what could have happened. Mel, where the fuck did you come from? And where are your corrective lenses? I had laser eye surgery, which I'm assuming will fail by the next episode. Well, whatever doesn't work, so what do you think happened? Yeah. Tell me more. Do you remember little Sparky? Any of you? Okay. So I think that he and Carly had some sort of new liaisons together. Hey there, you little Sparky. You got your little I'll kick your dirty. What do you mean, Carly? I was masturbating. It's only an inch. It's not like I was fully hard, but I could have got hard and like the opposite. Instead of declining him when he was old, sitting there and he's like, Oh, that's not. But if you've seen me hot, it's a Burberry one. So I think that he succumbed to him in a vignette I like to call Remember It. Oh, well, what says I get you to the Irish plateau? And if not, it'll be something nice and small to suck. <laughs> Come on in. Oh, oh, so nice. It's good. It's real good. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I just did. Anyways, I think the story gets more thought provoking. Carly. <laughs> You're a big fucking homo. I'm gonna tell everyone. Unless you give me thirty-five hundred dollars a day, I am gonna fucking tell everybody. I'm gonna call you Poofy, Poof Daddy. That's right. That's awful. Hey, um, you're going to call me Poof Daddy? Can nobody take my pride? Can nobody hold me down? Oh no. I've got to keep on moving. That's right. In the case, I haven't any money to be paying you. I'm waiting for me income tax, which should be coming shortly. I'm sure no one would go and spend it on PCP and do the super things and stuff. So if you want money, you can go suck my dick. I suppose you could do it because I just suck yours. So. I think we can safely conclude that Carly did not want the rumors now when he engages in the homosexual acts. I'm sure none of you have ever done anything questionable. So I think we can assume he did this in the bathroom.
anyways, what do you think, Mark and Snow person? Uh, but again, I was not residing here then, so now I can only speculate. I will say he was on drugs or old money for drugs. I'm ready to turn in. I can go in the bathroom and fucking just do something and you can speculate all you want. So if you don't mind. That motherfucker cocksucker trip for booze, but I suppose he's right, I did my thought maybe we are quick to jump to the conclusions and speculate. Yes, probably we are speculating too much. I mean, I will bet that Stu is in there simply washing his hands or picking a bowel movement. Do, 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 do. Some movement. Anyone? Anyone? All right. Punishment, bitch. It's a good thing 